Hey, fire signs. Welcome in. Welcome in, you guys. Just want to make sure I'm rolling. Um, this is messages coming through for you August 22nd. Doesn't mean it's going to happen on... What have I done here? What have I done? Uh, doesn't mean it's going to happen on August 22nd. It's just messages that want to come through. So pay attention to titles of the video. They reflect the entire reading. In fact, most many of the times it's about the extended. So if there's a message in here for you, because the, the title of the reading is very, uh, I don't know, resonant with you, there's a message in it. Um, also, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So if your sun sign isn't resonating for you today, check out your Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Just take what resonates, leave what doesn't, okay? Feel free to swap around the characters. Okay, let's get on with this, MJ. I did also did a live today, a September love forecast for all the Zodiac. It was really cool. It's about you, empowering. How, how can I empower, how can I be empowered to have love come in or what can I do to have love come into my life? Mending. This is Aries, Leo, Sag. Soulmate energy here to the sea. Okay, so I feel like some of you are healing from a relationship that is a soulmate relationship. Some of you are mending so that a soulmate can come into your life. Um, let's see where we go here. I do feel like there's a, a, a mending that's necessary between soulmates a higher vibration that's necessary, some kind of, of reconciliation, some kind of um, I'm sorry, some kind of thing. So that moving toward the sea, moving to more feelings. One more, please. One more. What's going on for Aries, Leo, Sag? Okay. Aries, Leo, Sag. King of Pentacles, dealing with a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. Woo! Seven of Swords, Ace of Wands, Chariot. All right, Fire Signs, are you dealing with a Cancerian? Who um, may have been lying in the past, but now they're offering a new beginning. They want a new beginning. Okay, there's something. Ugh. Yucky, yucky, yucky. Hold on. There you are. King of Wands, Tower, leaving something behind that was really not good for you. Okay? Could be dealing with a Cancerian energy or a Capricorn Taurus Virgo. I feel like um I feel like there was some really weird stuff going on in this relationship. Seven of Swords, so that's lack of there's there's lying there's deceit that's the thief card i feel like the cancerian energy um fire sign could be could be stealing your passion from you or something um could be you know uh sucking energy from you in order to move forward i feel like you are in this place of eight of swords five of swords feeling like you've been taken advantage of feeling burdened feeling overwhelmed by somebody, okay, or feeling overwhelmed by the situation. Have heart though, okay, because King of Wands, um, Tower coming through. And this is a little bit, uh, the order of the day has been kind of about self reflective, sort of looking at one's own responsibilities or behaviors in this. I feel like this, this water sign or this ch Cancerian energy is very. Um, is being very disingenuous. Five, uh, seven of Swords. It's like Lucy with the football. Nine of Swords, Three of Cups. Uh, yeah, okay. This person um, is afraid of moving forward in their life. I feel like they're going to keep offering you a new beginning and then they pull it away, right? Like Lucy with the football. Um, I feel like they're very disingenuous with you. I feel like they lie with they lie a lot. They're not very um, good. I feel like you, in turn, have felt trapped and burdened by this person. And then once in a while, you know, you get a mm, you get a little um, leg up, and you feel like a King of Pentacles here. I feel like this person has 
tried to, if they're offering you a new beginning, I would not go for it. I would not. I would not. Page of Wands, Knight of Wands. Yeah, they're like player energy in some way. Uh, Page of Wands, Knight of Wands. I feel like this needs to end for you to move forward toward a soulmate because um, I feel like you are in this King of Wands energy, okay? And it's like enough of this bullshit. Enough. I've had it, okay? And I'm not going to take it anymore. You know, have, have you ever seen Network? One of the most fantastic movies on the planet. Um, I'm mad as hell and I'm not going to take it anymore, right? That's what I feel like you're saying here. I'm mad as hell and I'm not going to take this anymore, okay? I feel like this water sign or this earth sign has been very, um, has been uh, pulling that football away. And things are changing now. Five in the middle here, five of swords within five days. Um, that's very fast energy of like, you know, you might not have really even seen it. Okay, you see how the Eight of Swords, she's blindfolded, the Ten of Wands is looking away. I feel like you might have, you know, uh, toted that barge and lifted that bail and not getting drunk and landing in jail. I feel like you've been very um, dutiful. Okay, I feel like you've tried to be on the up and up, but every once in a while, no, every once in a while, you kind of get your gumption up, you kind of get your anger up, and you're, you're like, mm, you know, there's like a little bit of a screw you feeling to that, to me. And this person may offer you a new beginning, um, but I do feel like it's very... I would not trust this person. I feel like they are doing things to make themselves feel better. They might offer you a new beginning because it makes their ego feel better. I feel like they're very immature. Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Wands. Knight of Pentacles is mature, okay? More mature than their age. It's like someone who's been forced to be more mature than who they really are. And it's actually not real. It's just like they're they're getting a cookie from a grown-up, like um when I was in high school, my father passed away when I was a freshman in high school. And I remember people saying to me, oh, how grown up you are and everything like that. But in reality, I was just doing it because I was just doing that because I was like having no, I had no capability or skill set of uh, metabolizing the death of a parent. And I didn't know what, how to do. And so I saw my mother being, you know, kind of falling down around me and my family just being very upset by this whole thing as they should have been even though it was a long illness, ALS, um, when it actually happened, when my father passed away, there was no s tools for anybody to sort of metabolize this. And so the rug was constantly getting pulled out from underneath me. And also I was acting like a grown up when I should have been asking for, you know, you, as a kid, like it's not your job to be the one who helps the family through things like that. It's really not. But as a spiritually advanced person, now that I look back at it, I realize that I was the one who had a spiritual mission. And so I was just going to that, right? I didn't know what I was doing. I feel like that's what you're doing here is like, you have a spiritual mission here too, fire sign. You have a place to go. This other person is just screwing with you. Like, and you're, this other person is acting. And I don't mean to say like, this person is acting like they are so responsible, like they're such the big man on campus or the big person they're really very immature and so they're pulling the rug out from under you every time you sort of fall for it whenever you fall for the ace of cups ace of wands here because i don't believe they have intention of following through i think they're just like it's an ego it's an ego thing for them okay so i want to know more before we move on to the extended i want to know more about this tower death, justice, two of cups. So this has to happen in order for you to move toward love. And we'll look at that in the extended. I see Scorpio here. I see Libra here. Somebody who's more advanced, somebody who is, could be a, another uh, fire sign or a somebody who is a king, somebody who is a real grown up or is a real, you know, person who is available to you and not the game playing that I'm seeing here. You see the nine of wands. Now he's got his eyes wide open. 
he he's leaning on all of his experiences here okay he knows no more game playing okay because this is what has to happen justice is coming okay when this old game playing thing gets done all right and i feel like that's what's coming is that you as the legit grown up in this relationship i feel like you could both could have gone into your knights your knights way of being okay you could have both been immature about this or something like that and now it's time to put those weapons down and really be like you know what we're just going around and around in this kind of bullshit i really want to move forward into something that's real so some of you could be divorcing a person who keeps who keeps like pulling the football away from you some of you could be doing that or being divorced because you're the person who keeps pulling the football but fire sign i do feel like if you're the one who is going toward this two of cups all right i do feel like that's because there could be two fire signs here i'm just saying but if you're involved with a water sign that definitively is the one who's pulling the football away okay all right so let's see where we go i'm gonna do the extended i will uh link is below for you fire sign i'll see you over there